Like we have very different and, and very characteristic destination. If you go to Hamburg in the north, for example, or to the northern coastline, it's very different from Bavaria in the south or from the Rhineland region with Cologne and Düsseldorf or eastern Germany with Leipzig and Dresden. So each city, each destination have very specific offerings and you know a lot of cultural aspects play in there and a lot of a lot of diversity I would say. convention where we like to market Germany as you know our slogan is discover German expertise so the idea behind that is really that you know Germany is a leader in some key areas of business and science so when you bring your meeting to Germany you can tap into this local expertise you can connect with local companies you know you can increase or expand your network with local business leaders and we try to, to help with that and to promote that Apart from that, I mean, the trends that we see are certainly sustainability, digitalization that are playing uh, an increasingly important role in our industry. Please tell us some of the high-end getaways we're planning. Again, I mean, most people who come to Germany, they probably know the large cities. They know Frankfurt, Munich, Hamburg, Berlin. But I think it's also worthwhile to visit some some of the smaller gems, I like to call them. Like, for example, if you go to, um, to Dresden in Saxony, you have a wonderful Baroque architecture. It's a very walkable city and it's really it, it really has a wow effect. Or if you go to Regensburg in Bavaria, you know, some of the smaller cities, they are very often surprising. And um, I think that's certainly worth a visit amongst many others in Germany. Thank you.